This video was taken at the Florida Railroad Museum in Parrish, Florida. One of the attractions of the Florida Railroad Museum is a 13-mile round-trip train ride that lasts approximately one hour and 20 minutes. At 18 minutes into our ride, we came upon this siding, and this was where the engine was going to switch to the back of the train to pull us back to the museum. So we will pull up to the switch up ahead, unhitch, then the switch engine will move over onto the side track, go back behind us, and then rehook onto the train to pull us back to the museum. It's now time to unhitch the engine. First, the train man closes the angle cocks, shutting off the high pressure air brake lines on both the car and the engine. Then he uses a lever called a cut bar to pull the locking pin on the coupling knuckles. The conductor turns this wheel to set the parking brake on the railroad car so it doesn't roll once the train's disconnected. The train man steps around to the side of the engine to protect himself, and the conductor tells me to step back because when the train pulls apart, the air hose, the high pressure air hose for the brakes disconnects, and it's dangerous to be anywhere near it. Look in the description below this video for links that will take you to YouTube videos showing the connecting and disconnecting of railroad cars. Now the train man must get down from the engine and switch the track. Once the engine is past the switch, the train man must go back and return the track to a straight position. Now the engine passes by us as it goes to the other end of the train and reconnects. It will be pushing us in a backing up maneuver all the way down to the end of the track where the maintenance shop is where they rebuild the cars and then he will take us back to the station. 
to hold down on the length of the videos, I'll post three more videos I took at the Florida Railroad Museum. One will be of the railroad stock up at the main entrance, one will be of the train ride, and the last one will be our time when we're in the maintenance yard and seeing the rolling stock there that they're trying to rebuild. Thank you for watching this video. Please give me a like and subscribe so you can see more videos that I'll be posting. Thank you.